Yeah, yeah. No, no. It's like this. If if you're the God of Rap and you're, you're the Jay Z's and you're the Little Wayne's and you're the Nas, Pimp C's, whoever people worship, the Tupac's, the the Biggies, whoever you worship as the best rapper alive, then that's how there's like sections in the world. Like, okay. I'm this person, I'm Jay-Z right here, I'm Kanye right here, you know what I'm saying, I'm Drake right here, I'm Lil Wayne right here, I'm Nicki Minaj right here. People drop stuff and, and how do I make this even more clear at events? So if there's a, the great rapper here, the great rapper here, great rapper here, there are sections that you as a person have to reach to hit those, those great rappers as a style. So what what I did and I, what I thought of is if I well my favorite rapper my favorite rapper was Lil Wayne so I was like I have to hit his his status like man I never heard stuff like that now that I'm my own self and I like man that's who started me off like spinning really cool all the other rappers still have people that they started off too so you have to hit their level now with you hitting their level and i already hitting my level and actually finding myself you have to hit your level you have to work hard as you think that rapper worked hard you have to try to be creative as you think that rapper be creative as you have to think about is this really what you want? Like that rapper thought about it. You also have to become a better person for your own self. Like that rapper probably became better for his or her own self to actually achieve their true personal legend. As Coelho would say, or your ultimate greatness as any person that Sapien and Wise would say. By becoming great, you are great. There's days when you will feel sad and you'll feel all uh, bummed down. But that's a day. You have life to live. You do. No, honestly. Now, what I was saying earlier is about hitting these sectors of rappers. You have to one day create your own sector so someone can try to hit yours. And that's what I'm trying to do and inspire youth and, and our people. That's what I'm trying to do here. In the, in the most nicest way possible so they can see there's no harm towards them. And being over here, now people hitting my sector and say, hey, I want to be like this guy, feels amazing. And uh, I, I can't do nothing else but smile because now I have a sector that people are trying to hit. That's amazing that I can see myself as great as the other rappers. It's a lie to not see yourself as great or greater. They know that. They know that. And you know that now. You know what I mean? Absolutely. It's okay to see yourself as great if you believe you are great. Believing that you are great, you have now became great. You're great. And that's how I believe to myself all those other days. So now that I have my own sector, I feel amazing. And that's what I'm doing right here. In this new theater building. So I thank you, God, for allowing me to be in this place alone and express myself. And even when other people are around. In this little spot right here. So the next person that comes here in the future, this is what I was doing, man. This is who I was, man. This was my view right here. Hold on, my camera not... I got my other lens. Let me lower it down for y'all. I just hope I can inspire y'all. Inspire y'all. <laughs> what does that mean? Inspire. You got to be able to laugh at yourself. And this was my view. So... Goodbye, man. Reporting live from Lamb Legend Already Made. Just know I'm doing this because I care about the future and I care about the youth. And I love y'all.